Hi, I'm Lisa Armstrong and today I'm going to create the perfect party look and I'm going to show you some tips and tricks that are going to help you achieve a more youthful look. So with our cotton pad we're just going to go up the forehead and we're going to go under the eye and upwards and we're going to keep it in a nice upward motion because we don't want to drag the skin down. Refreshing the skin, keep the skin hydrated underneath the makeup. It's going to keep the skin nice and primed and it also acts as great as a barrier between the foundation which we're applied to our skin in a bit. It's just basically plumping the skin and any fine lines that you might have around the under lip and the top lip. It's just going to tighten. It just acts as a barrier and it won't let your eye makeup and your eyeshadow crease into any fine lines. And we're going to keep the colour nice and matte. And this is for a more youthful appearance. If you have too much sparkle or too much shimmer, it literally clings to the creases of the eyes and it actually makes the eyes heavier. So that's just literally underneath the brow bone here. And that's just going to add shape and definition. Obviously it won't look too harsh, which is what we don't want. Harsh is ageing. So we're just going to put a lighter shade, nice and soft, underneath the brow bone and the inner corner of the eye. This will sculpt the eye and make the eye pop. We're going to go along our lash line. Nice, soft and gentle. So that will give the illusion that the eye is lifted up, we're never going to drag the eye down. So this is literally going to lift up your lashes and make your eyes feel much more open and wider. Little zigzaggy motions up the lash right into the root. We're just going to apply them from straight from the pack with the tweezers pop them in some glue and we're literally going to pop just a couple in any gaps or spaces. Just gently take a soft powder matching the colour of the brow and just feather the powder through the brow which will then give the illusion that the actual brow is fuller than it actually is. Now blended that into the foundation with a brush and now we're going to pat the rest of the concealer with the finger up close to the under eye. It's just going to set that concealer and again it's not too thick and it's not too dense so it's nice and fine so it literally will not stick into any fine lines around the under eye area and that's going to make the cheeks Appear to be fuller. Blending it into the cream blush. No harsh contouring lines. So using a lip line will just act as a barrier. By applying with a lip brush, it also helps to make your lipstick last for longer because you're literally patting it into the lip. Forehead down the T-zone and to either side of the nose. And there you have the finished look. Party ready!